CPT comes from the Latin verb meaning take, seize. Capture, which is what a captor has done to a captive, has the same meaning. Captivate once meant literally capture, but now means only to capture mentally through charm or appeal. But in some other English words this root produces, such as those below, its meaning is harder to find. Reception, 1. The act of receiving. 2. A social gathering where guests are formally welcomed. Although the reception of her plan by the board of directors was enthusiastic, it was months before anything was done about it. Reception is the noun form of receive. So at a formal reception, guests are received or welcomed or taken in. A bad TV reception means the signal isn't being received well. When a new novel receives good reviews, we say it has met with a good critical reception. If it gets a poor reception, on the other hand, that's the same as saying that it wasn't well received. Intercept to stop, seize, or interrupt, something or someone, before arrival. The explosives had been intercepted by police, just before being loaded onto the jet. Since the prefix inter means, between, see inter, it's not hard to see how intercept was created. Arms shipments coming to a country are sometimes intercepted, but such interceptions can sometimes be understood as acts of war. In football, soccer, and basketball, players try to intercept the ball as it's being passed by the other team. In years gone by, letters and documents being carried between officers or officials were sometimes intercepted when the carrier was caught. Today, when these communications are generally electronic, an intercepted email isn't actually stopped but simply read secretly by a third party. Perceptible noticeable or able to be felt by the senses. Her change in attitude toward him was barely perceptible, and he couldn't be sure he wasn't just imagining it. Perceptible includes the prefix per dash, meaning through, so the word refers to whatever can be taken in through the senses. A perceptive person picks up minor changes, small clues, or hints and shades of meaning that others can't perceive. So one person's perception, a tiny sound, a slight change in the weather, a different tone of voice, often won't be perceptible to another. Susceptible, 1. Open to some influence, responsive. 2. Able to be submitted to an action or process. She impressed everyone immediately with her intelligence, so they're now highly susceptible to her influence and usually go along with anything she proposes. With its prefix sus dash, up, Susceptible refers to something or someone that takes up or absorbs like a sponge. A sickly child may be susceptible to colds, and an unlucky adult may be susceptible to back problems. A lonely elderly person may be susceptible to what a con man tells him or her on the phone. And students are usually susceptible to the teaching of an imaginative professor, that is, likely to enjoy and learn from it. FIN comes from the Latin word for end or boundary. Final describes last things, and a finale, or a finish, is an ending. And at the end of a French film, you may just see the word fin, but its meaning is harder to trace in some of the other English words derived from it. Confine, 1, to keep, someone or something, within limits. 2, to hold, someone, in a location. He had heard the bad news from the CEO, but when he spoke to his employees he confined his remarks to a few hints that sales had slipped. Confine means basically to keep someone or something within borders. Someone confined to a bedroom or a wheelchair is too ill or disabled to be anywhere else. A person under house arrest is confined to his or her house by the government. At a business meeting, the discussion may be confined to a single topic. A town may keep industrial development confined to one area by means of zoning. And someone confined to the state prison for 20 years has probably committed quite a serious crime.
definitive, one, authoritative and final. Two, specifying perfectly or precisely. The team's brilliant research provided a definitive description of the virus and its strange mutation patterns. Something definitive is complete and final. A definitive example is the perfect example. A definitive answer is usually a strong yes or no. A definitive biography contains everything we'll ever need to know about someone. Ella Fitzgerald's famous 1950s recordings of American songs have even been called definitive, but no one ever wanted them to be the last. Finite having definite limits. Her ambitions were infinite, but her wealth was finite. It has come as a shock to many of us to realize that resources such as oil and the atmosphere's ability to absorb greenhouse gases are finite rather than unlimited. The debate continues as to whether the universe is finite or infinite and, if it's finite, how to think about what lies beyond it. Religion has always concerned itself with the question of the finite, that is, human life on earth, versus the infinite, God, eternity, and infinity. But finite is mostly used in scientific writing, often with the meaning definitely measurable. Infinitesimal, extremely, or immeasurably small. Looking more closely at the research data, he now saw an odd pattern of changes so infinitesimal that they hadn't been noticed before. Just as infinite describes something immeasurable, without limit, infinitesimal describes something endlessly small. When Antony van Leeuwenhoek invented the microscope in the 17th century, he was able to see organisms that had been thought too infinitesimally small to exist. But today's electron microscope allows us to see infinitesimal aspects of matter that even Leeuwenhoek could not have imagined.